This is a video of an 8.2 mile round trip paddle on the Jordan River from 1500 north in Lehigh, Utah to the Jordan Arrows Dam and back. We'll put in underneath the 1500 north bridge, paddle north downriver to the Jordan Arrows Dam buoy barrels, and then paddle back upstream to 1500 north. Since as of 2020 there aren't any public river access points in the Jordan Arrows, paddling this section requires you to paddle back upstream from the dam to get back to a public access point. So you'll probably want to be in decent shape, have a boat that paddles well, and make sure it's not a windy day to do this paddle. But the current in this section is usually pretty mellow since the Jordan Arrows Dam backs up the river water and slows it down, so paddling upstream in this section usually isn't too hard. This golf cart bridge is next to the Thanksgiving Point Trailhead Park, which has nice restrooms, a drinking fountain, and a nice parking lot. As of 2020, Lehigh hasn't put in a river access ramp here unfortunately, but you can use the slightly awkward area underneath the golf cart bridge as a river and park access point. This nice cement boat ramp is on private property and not for public use. Informational signs on the paved Jordan River Parkway trail here explain that this is an area where Native Americans used to ford the river and from 1858 to 1869 the Indian Ford Ferry and the Central Overland Trail crossed the river here. But once the first transcontinental railway line was finished in 1869, the ferry and central overland trail were no longer needed by people traveling across the country. the river boys before the Jordan Arrows Dam and Pump House. In the summer up to 90 percent of the water from the Jordan River is diverted into canals here in the Jordan Arrows. So weak river flow after this dam 
plus the surrounding private land with no trespassing signs, make portaging and paddling past this point in the Jordan Narrows impractical. So this is where we will turn around and paddle back upstream to where we started. our group about 1 hour and 15 minutes to paddle from 1500 north to the Jordan Narrow Dam Boys. On the paddle back upstream the group spread out more and the time for people paddling back upstream ranged from an hour and a half to 2 hours and 15 minutes. So the paddling time for the total round trip ranged from 2 hours and 45 minutes to 3 and a half hours depending on the paddler. For more information on this and other navigable sections of the Jordan River, see Elliot Mott's book on the Jordan River Water Trail or the Jordan River Commission's online Jordan River Water Trail map.